Hi there, I'm John Gibbons. Today I'm going to show you how to make a switch axis vase. Uh, a switch axis is where you take the spiral that usually ends up on the bottom of the vase and you switch it so that it can be displayed on either side of the vase. Um, I, you can also watch my cane pulling video on how I make all these canes um, on my other YouTube video. Okay, so we're just gonna give it a squeeze. Make sure all the canes stick together. So I'm making the collar. Making the collar to pick up the canes. And I've got to make it match the uh, pie dividers. This is kind of a little piece all on its own. It'd be a good idea to practice this a few times. Where's my uh, broom? Okay, you got it. When you're squeezing these canes together, you gotta go nice and slow because I've, I've done it so hard and it, and it breaks, the glass breaks. So you gotta go nice and slow, make sure it's hot enough. Whew. Okay, so now I'm twisting it, twisting it on the marber in place and that initiates my my twist in the cane work. Okay, so now we're just gonna let it cool and I'm gonna get it really hot and melt in all the, all the bumps. So it doesn't trap any air bubbles. Okay, so I'm gonna take a gather and then I'm gonna pull this part out. Can you get me the little jack? And then I'm gonna I'm going to cut the bottom off and that will give me that really tight spiral. It's called a termination. Okay. find like an ideal spot because sometimes there's a little scuzz in the glass or some bubbles and so I'm gonna make my bubbles 
on the bottom. So Matt's going to start making the uh, the collar, the other blowpipe, to go into this into this hole. All right, so there's my hole. Now I'm going to ream it out with this uh, pair of tweezers here. You got to make it about as big as the next, about as big as the blowpipe coming in to, to stick into that hole. Okay, that's good. Lift. Go ahead, cap it. Okay, I think I might have needed more moil next time, you know? More moil. Maybe on a more collar. Like on the I don't know, I think it'll work. It's it's fine. Like like thicker or higher up on Like the more that way okay. so that it kinda has more of a transition, but I think it'll be fine. Okay, so I'm just getting it back into that functional shape and uh, then I'll take another gather on it and we'll make we'll make the form I'm gonna block it again though Let me get that uh, big block. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go to the marver. Can you uh, give it a wipe? Off. Throw back in the heat. Let me see it real quick. Go ahead, take it. Can you give that a puff? Ready? Yeah. Maybe hang it a little. Okay. Not cap it. Rotate the other way. Off. Stop. Okay, hang on a sec. Give that a flash. And so rotate. All right, let me pull it again. Okay. Okay, lift. Good, give that a five. Okay. 
Okay, give that another flash. Okay, I hope you learned a lot. I hope you learned how to do a switch axis. Um, I'd say the most difficult part for me to learn how to do the switch axis was, uh, I don't know, learn how to poke the hole. But it's, it's good to torch the glass and have someone blow. And you wanna make sure you really torch that glass a lot before they start blowing, or you get a blow hose and you can blow yourself. And then, uh, yeah, just practice. I've made a lot of those things, so. I hope that helped. Thanks for watching. I'm John Gibbons. Have a great day.